All right, we're working here at the Crocker this morning, making some little projects here out of clay. These are going to be snow globes. That's a little too tall for your globe, huh? You might have to trim it. You might have to trim my lollipop or flower or whatever that is. I think yours is better without it. We'll leave it out. Uh, Pam Fisgetti here with the Crocker to talk about some of these cool gift ideas that really bring out the creativity in kids, and everything is so hands-on. Yes, yeah, so when I do the buying for the shop, I really think about the kids that are coming through the museum and how whatever's happening in the museum can come back and they can be inspired to take part of that home with them. So we do snow globes during the holidays, but we do have a lot of glass, a glass exhibit, so I, I like to have that little inspiration. They can feel, oh, I can do this too. And then if we want to... Yeah, let's take a quick look here at the snow globes because you've been working hard here. Tell me what you're making. I'm making my puppy banjo. Your puppy banjo, who happens to have spots... Is that what you're putting on, the, yes, the spots? The spots. Yeah. Okay, so Banjo's getting his spots. Look how cute. She did a great job. We'll turn it around. And so this just is going to go something like this when she's all done. And she has her very own snow globe. What a great idea. And then the ladies over here are doing some different projects. Pam, what do we have uh, right here? This is one of my favorite pieces because it's actually the kids get to create their own museum. So they're the curator of the museum. They get to decide the artwork, the placement. They actually set up the whole museum. This one actually looks a little bit like the historical wing of the Crocker. And they get to be the visitor and the buyer. And, and, so, and so they can actually invite their family or their uh, friends over and they get to share their homemade museum. Yeah, somewhere. they it could be a traveling museum, which yeah. is kind of fun. And then this one is really cool. What's this? So these are soapstone, and this was inspired by an exhibit that's actually opening Sunday, Loot Vanderveen. And um, so they're little animals, and it's just a great tactile uh, project for kids that they can actually be successful at um, creating their own little sculpture. So they get to, to um, file it, and then they add wax, so they add the sheen, so it's, it's, it's fun. And like Pam said, they incorporate uh, exhibits here at the museum. And this here is a look at some of the sculptures, some of the larger scale sculptures that are going to be up on the third floor. And that's kind of relating to what she's doing. Absolutely, yes. And so hopefully they're inspired and they can come into the store and see all sorts of things that we have going on. Okay, well, we're going to stick around, guys. Coming up next hour, we're going to take a walk around the store here, get a look at some of the great stocking stuffers and other creative uh, gifts for your kids this holiday season. Back to I love museum gift shops. I know, right?